Hey, Dr. Charlie Rouse, and we want to thank you for giving us your time to show you how to have better health. There's a lot of things out there in this world of healthiness that aren't always healthy. And today we're going to get right down to it. It's the flagship, the flagship nutrition for Is Experia, O-P-C. When you get down to uh, undoing those letters, it is so complicated, don't even go there. O stands for oligomer, that just means you got a, this one hooked to that one, hooked to that one. That's what an oligomer is. PC stands for procyanidine, and who knows what that is but a biochemist. But here's the neat thing, double-blind medical studies. We're talking about a group of people over here get the real McCoy, and a group of people over here get diddly squat. They don't get anything. And when you get through, you can start saying, hey, did you guys feel better? And they start measuring, measuring by medical science who got what. Now, in OPC are the buzzwords that are very important to you. Resveratrol. Wow. Resveratrol. The difference in OPC Plus and all the rest of the resveratrols out there is the quality and the quantity. Most of them are skimping, and they're only giving you the name on the label, not the stuff in the jar or the pill. And then you come down to Charlie's most favorite vitamin in the whole wide world. One is a grape, uh, whether it's the skin or the juice. I love grape juice. But the seed, yeah, the seed. And look, God says, Genesis 1, verse 29, the seed, the seed of the herb, the fruit of the tree. And if God said it, Come on now, that settles it. So we learn that God has given us an intro into simple nutrition. The seed of the herb, the fruit of the tree. Yes, and how many of you are prone to eat any kind of seed? No, you go to the grocery store, you look for grape seedless, and if you get a watermelon, you pluck all them bad black seeds out of there or pucker and spit. But let me tell you something. Did you know, this is just neat science, in one black watermelon seed, it has the capacity of absorbing from the ground 200,000 times its own weight. It's an amazing ability for a watermelon to draw all the nutrition and all the water and, all, and build a green coating and a white rind and a juicy. But look here, we're talking about the grape today. Powerful nutrition and in the grape seed. Then we come along and we realize that, look, when you put these two together, you have what is known as energy, energy. Inside the cell is a mitochondria. And all that means is that is the factory where God makes the energy. And if you want to stoke the furnace, if you want to make sure that you got the energy, then you got to go there. But listen, what happens when you got energy in the cell? Well, let's say you got over here, you need an issue of insulin has to pump to take down the sugar molecule. The sugar can't go too high because we become sick, and the sugar can't go too low because we become hypo, and you gotta be just right. So what happens? You need energy to run that factory. So if you're looking for better glucose metabolism, better blood sugars, resveratrol and grape seed, it's the things that we're looking for. Then we come along and we realize that in this energy is this stuff. These are the building blocks for collagen. Well, what is a collagen, Dr. Charlie? Collagen is what makes things smooth between the bones like cartilage. But most of you are gonna love collagen because it makes the skin smooth. And if you don't want wrinkles and you want your skin to be elastic and more flexible, and not, you know how you don't want to beat up your, bump up against something and tear it real easy like a piece of paper? That's called collagen. Resveratrol grapeseed build natural collagen in your body. Another thing that I like about grapeseed and resveratrol is they reduce inflammation. And you know, when you look at uh, inflammation, 
gracious, that can be anywhere, can it? You can get it caught in your nose called a sinus problem. You can get it down here in your lung called a bronchial bronchitis problem. You can get it down here in your knee. What do they call that? Neitis? Who knows what you got? Wherever it's at, the knee, the hip, the back, the skin may become inflamed. You may even get sunburn, but inflammation is everywhere. So inflammation, resveratrol, grape seed, things to do. And look, how many diabetics do you know that the doctor says, you better take very good care, retinal degeneration, retinal neuropathy, that's inflammation in the back of the eye. Or how many people do you know who have macular degeneration, the degeneration of the macular? Inflammation started all that stuff. And when you take down inflammation, the body's gonna be much healthier. The neat thing about resveratrol and grapeseed is it's one of the only, it's not the only, but it's one of the only neat nutritionals that God allows to cross the blood-brain barrier. Now the blood-brain barrier is your protective zone up here in the head, but guess what? When it goes in, 20 minutes, 30 minutes after you swallow it, you're gonna think faster, you're gonna be more concentrating. That's a neat thing, so if you know somebody who needs to think better, it's called OPC. It's a neat way to go. Neat thing, isn't it? And we haven't even begun to look at the aspects of it. OPC, we're talking about resveratrol and grapeseed that removes, chelates, heavy metals. You know, there's a world of people out there with heavy metal toxicity. And we're not just talking about aluminum. Many of you hadn't eaten aluminum cans like a billy goat, but you've been injected with a vaccine before. And guess what? Whenever you have aluminum in the body, you better remove it. Or how about cadmium? Or how about lead? Or how about mercury? All of those are heavy metals. Or how about iron overload? You may know somebody who has iron hemochromatosis. They're too much iron. Man, that'll make people very sick. Grapeseed extract and resveratrol are medically known to remove heavy metals. When that happens, the arteries get healthier, the veins get healthier, things become more apt to be energetic. And when you start removing inflammation out of the body, hay fever, sinuses, ears, lungs, nose, they all go better and better. And here we go. We're talking about the world of OPC. But you know what made this product superior, synergistically more powerful than all the others? Once you start running resveratrol and grapeseed together, we found from the Brazilian rainforest way down south, these guys have a palm tree that grows a berry, and they call it a sai e Now, they speak Portuguese down there. Down here in South Georgia, we call that aca, or acaia, or acai. But down there, it's a sai e Hey, and you know, really and truly, it has a lot to do with the sighing. Do you know somebody who sighs a lot? What do they need? They need more sunshine on the inside? Acai for the size. And if you know somebody got the mully grubs and the moody blues and they're just always snippy and snappy, acai. So we bring in acai, resveratrol, grapeseed extract, and we're now beginning to build better veins, better arteries, better capillaries. You got a, an acre and a half of capillaries in your human body. You better get those things healthy. What's one of the major inflammatory veins in the human body? Have you ever heard of people who say, I have uh, hemorrhoids? Ha <laughs> ha, there lies the answer. Resveratrol, grapeseed, and Asahi, pulling it together begins to build more nutritional, healthier veins. The veins get healthier. So how about it? Are you looking to feel 10 years younger, light years smarter, and a whole lot more energetic? Then go for it. What's in the mineral content of Asahi? Strontium, boron, silica, the chemistry that God makes in the mineral factory. What happens when we take in the power of the minerals? Stronger fingernails, healthier skin. Ah, so, but let me tell you, Dr. Charlie, I'm in my 60s now when I was in my 40s, I started using the nutrition of the procyanidines for headaches. And you know what? It works wonders. 
So you may know somebody who has chronic 